thing about real estate is it involves having to understand finance, it involves having to understand how policy works, zoning works, land use works. And I think there are people who want to have a degree that says real estate on it. And USC was really the first program out there, or school to offer a graduate level degree in real estate. I jumped at the opportunity to go to school there in the first program. And uh, after I graduated, uh, the program was immensely helpful. I felt the need to give back to the program and hopefully train real estate professionals for the future. Dollinger Master Real Estate Development Program was developed in 1986. And so we've been doing real estate education for about 30 years. At the Price School in particular, we have policy planning and development under one roof. It's great that it's here in Price because we really do have, take a much more balanced approach to real estate than any other program you'll see in the country. You need to understand the politics to make sure that what we build and provide meets the needs of the community and, and, and have a way to talk to the community. Every year, they go through a tremendous amount of planning to figure out how to modify all the classes to make them relevant with what's going on in real estate at the present. New classes, new professors, as well as the guest speakers. Being able to refresh with adjuncts as the market evolves and shifts and change is a critical element to giving students real-time data and information. That balance has really helped the Emirate program stay relevant over the last 30 years. Trying to be a developer as a young woman was not easy. Being able to say, well, in my graduate program we did this, or you know, in the Emirate program we did that. Being able to drop that in during a meeting all of a sudden gave me credibility that my age and my sex sort of denied me. I'm involved with the Women in Real Estate program through Price School as well. I was so pleased that we had this Women in Real Estate luncheon and this panel. Not only was did it give you a great opportunity to network with a lot of fantastic women, but really be able to have representation of women in real estate. The Emirate program really led me to get my first job in the real estate field. It gave me credibility, it gave me the knowledge, it gave me the skills that I needed. It was the practical experience that I love about the program that I value and will value forever. The MRED degree helped me uh, transition from service provider as a broker to uh, a, a developer or a sponsor. I had a lot of initial success. I was what you would call a back-of-the-envelope developer. And in 1992, we had a severe real estate uh, recession. I came about this far away from going broke. I realized that I had something missing that I needed to find and what that was was an advanced education in real estate. One of the, the best experiences that I had being part of the MRED was being on the NAOP team. We got really close as this group of five people attacking this real estate problem. In the end we ended up winning so that was really exciting. Meeting so many people, so many alum, and it was really a fantastic experience. What I take away most from the MRED is really the networking and the connections that I have. I got every one of my jobs after going through the undergrad program here at USC. I got through a USC connection. The real estate industry is one in which network really matters. Who you know, who knows you, the reputation that you've developed for yourself, really what drives your professional success. And so what will do with our students is really make sure they build those connections while they're in school. Students can interact with alumni, find out what those alumni do day to day in their jobs, help the students understand and answer the questions, is that the right career path for me? The alumni play a pivotal role for us both in terms of being our recruiting, mentoring, uh, they act are actively part of the admissions process, and then they help place students when we graduate. I was asked to come back and be an adjunct professor in the MRED program, and I was a professor for 16 years. For me, it was giving service and giving back to a program that gave so much to me. I've tried to pay it forward by always having my door open and always being willing to meet future MRADs. I interact with fellow Trojans all the time, personally, professionally. At Regency, we're a national company and we're building shopping centers all over the country. And what's amazing is we're really tapping into the Trojan network, not just in Southern California, Northern California, but in all the major markets across the country. The Trojan family is definitely a very real thing. At our company, I know we always look to hire USC uh, people first. The students that come out of the MRED program are just ready to hit the ground running. Supporting you know, people coming back to school and getting their education, I think is incredibly important to our community. I was the beneficiary of a scholarship coming through the MRED program. I was the first in my family to go to college, so to even conceive being able to go to graduate school at 
the University of Southern California never entered my mind. Being able to give kids an opportunity who wouldn't otherwise be able to afford it, it's critically important. I was fortunate enough to receive uh, the Lusk Scholarship, but that was only if I went enrolled full-time. So I, I made the decision to go full-time, and it was probably the best decision I made uh, as a student here. Having scholarships that open up the degree to people of a more diverse background, that understand the stakeholders in those neighborhoods and understand the kinds of projects that can get passed, I think would add a lot to our program. What I've gotten out of the Emirate program is that it's given me an opportunity to leave this place a little bit better than I found it. This is the city I grew up in. This is the city I'll probably die in. And so I really would like to be able to have an impact on a smaller scale um, that's a very personal impact and sort of let my entrepreneurial spirit sort of start to thrive again. Now that I finished, it really was the best decision that I could have made for my career. If I did not have my MRED degree, there's no way I would be in the place that I am in my career. It's been fantastic, and I'm happy to be a part of the Trojan family. The program has been an outstanding example of academic excellence at USC, graduating remarkable students into all aspects of the real estate industry who now play leadership roles. And I look so forward to the next 30 years and seeing all the accomplishments of the program ahead. <laughs>